Hey, this is Brett, and this 2022 Ram 2500 Crew Cab Short Box Laramie Level B package with the night edition is stock number 14284Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used heavy duty truck and Ram headquarters. This 2022 Ram 2500 has the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine, is paired up with the six speed 68 RFE automatic transmission. This truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off per the state of Wisconsin inspection process. And this truck is 100% ready to go. Little bit of housekeeping here. 19,870 pounds is the max tow rating on this truck and 2,140 pounds is the max payload. Found those numbers on Ram's tow guide website. I will link that in the description below. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the op options and just give you the most accurate representation that I can of the truck. Billet silver, metallics, the color. I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, consider subscribing to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications and get updates on the videos I do each and every day as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs vehicle and heavy duty truck walkarounds on YouTube. The night edition gives you the 20 inch black painted alloy wheels. It has Firestone Transforce AT tires. These are LT28560 R20s. I would say that these tires probably have about 80% of the tread left on them, maybe 80 to 90. Uh, very new tires on here. Frame and underbody is extremely clean. This is a one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax out of Oregon. Front fender is in excellent shape. You get the blacked out headlight bezels, part of the night edition, the LED lights, part of the Laramie Level B package, and the painted front and rear bumper is part of the night edition as well. No major dents or dings or chips on that front bumper. You also get the gloss black grille with the night edition. The hood is in fantastic shape. I didn't see any dents or dings on that. Passenger side front fender is in nice condition as well. Also, I'll turn all those LED lights on at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. Passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. And billet silver, it's got a lot of metal flake in it. Really a good looking color. A lot of fine metal flake. You get the blacked out 2500 Cummins and Ram logos there. And as you go down this side of this 2022 Ram 2500, take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away or even if close by, you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the truck, hear the truck, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart, and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. Now, if this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you. Back wheel's in excellent shape as well, and the back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. Frame and underbody looks really good. Has all the remaining factory exhaust. Definitely advantageous to get a truck out of Oregon. Lower rockers and cab corners look great. Passenger side box looks really good as well. No dents or dings on there. Does have the LED tail lamps. Painted rear bumper, no dents on that. Looks really good. Has the backup parking sensors, the full towing package, of course, with the receiver hitch four pin and seven pin wiring. And the tailgate is in really nice condition as well. I didn't see any dents or dings on there. Does have the blacked out four x four Ram and Laramie logos on the tailgate as well. Has the power drop down, shock down assist tailgate. A very nice spray and bed liner. You do get LED bed lighting back here, side box tie downs, and 115 volt, 400 watt plug in. And turn these lights on and off back here. That spray and bed liner goes onto the tailgate, which is nice. Shuts nice and solidly. And as you go down the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no major dents or dings on the box. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is in fantastic condition as well. Down the rest of this side, cabin doors all look really good. Has the heated fold up tow mirrors, built in directional signals, LED side lights. They fold up like so and in like that. Take a quick look at the back seats. 
No rips or tears back here. You get the latch child safety system. These back seats are heated on the outboard side. Power sliding rear window with the built-in rear defrost. You get these suede inserts on the bottom here. The gray piping has the load floor back here, which is a really nice feature. You got muddy boots or tools, put them on here. You're not gonna get your seats dirty or if you got pets, put both sides down. They got a nice flat place to lay and they won't get your seats dirty or wreck them. You have a receiver hitch reducer back here and storage area. You get the nice Berber floor mats. There are your heated seat buttons. 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in, two USBs and two USB-Cs. You also have in-floor storage with removable bins for easy cleaning. You can put ice and drinks in there and it's like you have too many coolers wherever you go or if you're not in Wisconsin, just extra storage space. Side current airbags on the front seats, child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look really good. Has the VIN sticker there. No Canadian trucks. Previously owned Canadian trucks here. Tire and loading information sticker. Inside the Laramie Level B package gives you the black leather and suede bucket seats in the front. No rips, no tears on them. It smells very clean inside this truck. I don't think it's ever been smoked in. Both these front seats are heated and cooled. You get the Berber floor mats up here as well. Auto headlamps and power pedals. Power windows, locks and mirrors. You get the suede insert on the door, kind of this diamond plated looking design on the doors as well. Memory driver seat. These mirrors do power fold in. I always like showing both sides so you know that both sides are working properly. And then you can control the blind spot mirrors. They are power as well, which is really handy for the passenger side blind spot mirror to be able to adjust that from the driver's seat is pretty convenient. Inside we have the seven inch LCD display, digital speedometer, compass display, battery voltage and uh, water temperature there. You can change all those corners to read pretty much whatever you want. 12,135 miles on this truck. Comes with the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, gear selector on the right as well. Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. It does have audio controls in the back of the steering wheel. There's your six speed automatic transmission with the optional tap shift, or well, the tap shift is right there, but it's the 68 RFE automatic transmission. This one has the Uconnect 5 uh, four, 12 inch radio. You get the factory navigation system there. There's Highway 41, so that is working nicely. You get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, AM, uh, auxiliary, USB, and Bluetooth hookups as well. Here are your climate controls, including your dual climate controls, including your heated and cooled seat and heated steering wheel buttons. And you can control the fan here, or you can control on the more tactile buttons on the side here. And then you get all your different apps. I'm not going to go through everything, but I'll go through most of them just so you can see everything that's on here. It does have Android Auto and Apple CarPlay. I believe they are wireless off-road pages, which are pretty cool. You can check out your backup camera. And they've made these backup cameras HD on the heavy-duty trucks with RAM. And you can zoom in on that receiver hitch to get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer the first time every time. You got your system and then other. And then uh, off-road pages are pretty cool, so I'll show you those. You get your steering angle right there, your transfer case, whether it's in two high, four high, or four low. And then you get your latitude, longitude, and altitude right there, as well as accessory gauges, and then your pitch and roll, which is pretty convenient if you're doing some off-roading. This one does have the Harman Kardon premium sound system. Down here is your push-button four-wheel drive, your factory brake controller, your factory exhaust brake, tow haul mode, front and rear parking sensors. You get two USBs, two USB-Cs, and an AUX jack. You also get a wireless cell phone charge pad, and way down there is a 115-volt, 400-watt plug-in. Keyless entry with remote start, power drop-down tailgate, sliding cup holders, and coin tray. Dual glove boxes, passenger side format and seat are in excellent condition as well. Once again, I don't think this truck's ever been smoked in. You get the speakers in the ceiling, part of that Harman Kardon sound system, headliners in great shape, map lights, assistant SOS buttons, and your power slide and rear window controls. Home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems, and then an auto dimming mirror. All right, let's start it up, take a look under the hood, and check out all those LED lights in the front. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. 
There are those LED side lights. They are super bright, look really good. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this truck all the way around inside and out. All those LED lights are very bright and work nicely. Under the hood we have the 6.7 liter Cummins diesel engine, engine base very clean, runs very smooth. Once again this truck has been fully safetyed and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change, all the fluids have been checked and topped off and this thing is 100% ready to go. I would venture to say that this might be the cleanest Ram that we have on our lot right now. Uh, there is the emission sticker. And uh, I would highly recommend this truck from a quality and condition standpoint. I would ship this one back to Oregon, California, Texas, New York, Florida. Whoever's gonna get this truck is going to be very happy with it. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got it. Go to the website right there at summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and heavy duty truck walk arounds on YouTube. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Ram 2500 truck videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2022 Ram 2500 crew cab short box, Laramie Level B night edition in billet silver metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.